Cargo ships transport the world, but why do I know? Absolutely? They're also very colorful and gigantic. Look at, oh my gosh, that takes up the entire shot. Why would you get on one in the first place if you didn't know where you were going? You could end up in like some island somewhere. To live I want to see if he ends up in one of those situations. For some reason, it's getting him 11 million views a month. So something's working. Let's figure out what. Is it even possible for a civilian like myself oh my. to get onto one? Wow. With over 90,000 active ships around the globe. Over 90,000, he says, and he is now one of them. You're going to get lost, Thomas. He's going to get lost. That's a pretty shot. I have ADHD. This did seem like a ridiculous idea. And he's naked. I like his sweater. I'd wear that sweater. But it's hot as hell. Why are you wearing a sweater? Ah, they're trying to get uh, their way in through a guy. They want to get to know a guy who knows a guy. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so now they got it. They got their guy. They're getting through the passcoded gate. How are they exactly going to get on there? Is this something that you want to do today? Or Yeah, she's just like, what are you even saying? We can't do this today. Besides, a gigantic ship that you can get lost Here, on. This. <laughs> Hi, Thomas. Our captain is open to the idea. Let me know yes. if you have any questions. So that means that they're going on a ship. I would be so scared, actually. Look at the open water. They're usually less than a day. They let that is a long ways to go. Could you do that? Could you like just go on a ship and, and, and wing it? Why is he always naked? We thought this would be impossible. I can't do that. I, I Next time I get on a plane, I am getting an aisle seat. I am going to throw up. Although it is a YouTube movie or video, it is still a filmmaking practice because the way that they use the music and the sequence that they just made for us is leading us up to the climactic points of what we are expecting. 6 a.m. So we're sleeping on the boat tonight. Oh my god, dude! That's so crazy! Oh, ah, that's so soon though! Oh my gosh, I would not be prepared. Yeah, my, my oh my gosh, this would be at like a 7 is happening there's just <laughs> that's me what if they fall off the boat, Hello. boat? Hello. 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 thank you wow oh they just got some passes there are some exclusive passes we're exclusive along for the ride god that is a gigantic area they have an elevator what that is a big ship when you need an elevator that's when you know you've wow. made it in ship oh there's snacks yeah. was it hot funnions though I don't know how comfortable those beds are. They seem to have woken up just fine and are looking around getting lost in this place. Look at how gigantic. You could search around this for a day and, and you'd be fine because you'd have other places to go. The big shots, shots that nobody cares about. That is so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. As a filmmaker, I'd want to take photos there and I suck at photography. You see, somehow, some way, my fear of heights would give me so much anxiety to where I'd probably make myself fall over the railing. How do you even do that? But I'd probably do that. Why is there a pool on a boat? And their logic from the beginning of the video, remember that? Captain Bah... 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 bah. Within minutes, so many of my questions were answered. This looks like the Titanic, and that is not a good thing, Thomas, because, um... Oh my gosh, they're just living the life. There's a basketball court? I am envious. So, let's see what they plan to do for the second day, because they got the go around, but they need to do something with it. We have to appreciate how they are experiencing it. Day 33, no food, no water and mauled by a iguana living in the plant and then he ate it and that is how you get into the ad read and brand deal gym sesh they're gonna have an equinox session that is new york city gym for you at like 50 bucks a day or something like that <laughs> did you see his cross-sided eyes that that is so me my head exploding is that the trainer he's probably the trainer right Handstand push-ups, that's how you do it. And then the safety inspection, because the boring stuff is fun. When they show all of the data, all of the intricacies of this technology, they go by it fast. Footage, you don't really want to see all of that. What they are getting into is the information behind the scenes. And the tunnels, where I would totally get stuck in that. Jesus, oh, nope, nope, claustrophobia. Wouldn't a fire drill over an ocean just be jumping into the ocean? Oh, uh, I feel suffocated just watching that. Uh, no, no. Are they dying and they don't know it is the problem. 
For some reason, he is always naked, but they are playing basketball on top of a ship that they are hitchhiking. Like, anyone else would probably have to pay a whopping $2 for that. No! The ball! That's totally a dad move right there. Did you see that? Though? Because after a lot of information and boring sequence stuff of this ship that they are on, we need some sort of spicing it up and have it as a big reveal for people to watch after watching your video for a while. Get a haircut by one of their lead engineers who had barely ever done it before. Okay. How many times have you done this? This is my like six or seven times. <laughs> he is a pro at seven times. We wanted to talk to them about what life. We need to be able to connect to other people within these videos because the part of the storyline is seeing the change and the excitement and the emotions throughout the other. We care about them because it's for engagement. We want to see how they affect the story. It's just such a wholesome feeling. They got to hitchhike, have fun, have an excitement and knowledgeable, uh, kind of terrifying time. And they did it targeting a really, really broad spectrum of audience. If you leave it with a bittersweet ending, you might get some tears. If you leave it with a funny ending, you might get trashed because you're not funny. 